Hey guys, it's Luna here. Welcome back to another Skyrim mod update video. Today we're going to be going over the Elven Chainmail mod. I have more mod and armor mod videos out today, so check them out. But first, as always, if you do enjoy this video, hit the thumbs up. I appreciate the support. And if you're interested in updates and guides for all the latest games, check out my channel. I'm sure you'll really enjoy it. Anyway, with all that out of the way, let's get straight into the video. The Elven Chainmail mod adds to Skyrim a new set of armor and one weapon based on the Elven armor in game. Traditionally being designed for Elven characters, it's a light armor, so if you install the mod, you can make these new light armors at the forge. However, you will require first the light armor smithing book, which you can find now in different locations across Skyrim. The locations are Crack Tusk Keep by the Smithing Forge on a table, Ember Shard Mine on the lower level of the larger area to the west on a table as well, Lord's House in Falkreath in the basement on top of a barrel in the corner, Silent Moon's Camp on the workbench near the Lunar Forge, Reachwind Burial Mound, which is an unmarked location, or if you have access to the Cheat Room or the QA Smoke Room, you can find them in a Skillbook Holder. And personally, I found the easiest one to reach is the Silent Moon's Camp, as it's outside and it's pretty close to Whiterun where I was. Once you have a copy, you can head over to the Forge and start crafting your new Elven Armors. Located under the Elven category, you will find three sets of Light Elven Armor, which are all the same looking and have the same stats as each other, and we will look at that in a little bit more detail but it's the colors which are different first the elven chainmail comes with the armor itself which is green and silver you get the boots and gauntlets to go with it none of these armors comes with helmets by the way you get the ivory version which is silver looking metal the material on the armor is an ivory color finally you get the thalmar color which is black and silver and it has a slight tinge of green through it to craft all of these it is the same as regular elven armor you will need iron ingots four moonstones leather and leather strips and at the armor workbench you can improve any of the, the armor pieces to flawless using a refined moonstone the elven chainmail armor resistance is actually slightly higher than regular elven armor with four more in all pieces so in my game for example elven armor the cuirass has an armor rating of 30 and the elven chainmail the new one has an armor rating of 34. so not a huge difference but the three pieces equipped it does protect you more noticeably in combat than a regular full set of elven armor now in case you couldn't already tell the armor is female only and uses the unp body so will overwrite any body mods you may have unless you're using the unp body itself or the cbbe or the unpb body which is supported finally for the armor anyway it's not enchanted so you can place on it whatever enchantment you like depending on your build now this mod is just not an armor mod it also adds one new weapon to the game and it's called the elven scimitar a new awesome looking sword and there is a lot of confusion as to where the weapon is actually found. The mod author doesn't really say, the description makes it sound like it can be crafted once you get the skill book, but in fact you're going to have to find this one in the game and it can be found somewhere where there are actually loads of people wearing elven armour and that is at Northwatch Keep across the water from Castle Valkahar. To get the scimitar, travel through the keep until you're near the end, and there's a torture room there with an interrogator. Once you kill him, on the back right corner, he has a whole bunch of weapons on a table, including the new scimitar. It's slightly bloody, but it's good to use. Also, keep in mind when you're here, on the bookshelf behind this table, there is actually a full set of the regular elven chainmail armor. The ivory and thalmor ones can still only be crafted at the forge. The elven scimitar looks absolutely amazing, I have to say. A mixture of elven and nordic carved, I can of thing it looks like and it goes perfect with the new elven chainmail for damage again it's the same as the armor just slightly higher than the regular elven sword it can also be improved at the grindstone and enchanted with whatever you feel it needs on it and that's pretty much all the info you need for the new elven chainmail mod anyway guys if you found this video useful don't forget to leave a like comment and subscribe i'll be back again soon with more weapon and armor videos but until then i will see you all next time for more skyrim special edition